This video is going to walk through creating and calling a test phone bank project. We're going to start by creating a group of voters who don't mind being our test subjects for us to place live calls to. Now we're going to run through the targeting process and keep only that group. On the output page, click Show Options for the Call Phone Bank section. Select a Save Into and Create New List. Let's name it our first test project and add a description of who it is we're calling. We need to select the caller ID that will appear when our volunteers are using the power dialing feature. If you have not validated the number you wish to use, it will not appear in the list, so click Add New, enter the phone number, and click Validate. You must be able to answer the incoming validation call to this phone number and enter the validation code supplied on the screen. Click record and enter the phone number where you wish to record the audio message volunteers can drop into voicemail boxes after they hear the beep. The volunteers can then proceed to the next call while the message is left. This can only be done when using the power dialing feature. After the recording is complete, you can preview it through the browser. Now create the introductory message you want volunteers to announce to the answered call. The volunteers will see this message and then a list of the targeted voters at this number as well as any other voters WebElect might expect could answer the call. When the volunteer clicks on the voter that has answered the call, the list of questions we want asked appear along with the groups tags that correspond to the answers. So add the questions and groups here. Click Save. That will take us out to the Phone Project listing page which shows all the projects we have created and the status of each. Hovering over the status graphs tells us the summary of the call completions. We can reach this page at any time by clicking the Phone Bank link on the main menu.